All right, now to a Scripps investigation that is getting results. The loophole allowing military sex offenders to easily evade registration has come to a close. This after President Obama signed a new law. As Scripps national correspondent Mark Greenblatt reports, the bill will help keep those military sex offenders from flying under the radar. With President Obama's signature now in place, a long-standing loophole that allowed military sex offenders to evade registration is finally closed. A recent Scripps News report revealed grim examples of the consequences of these cracks in the system. Senator Richard Burr sponsored the legislation, which became Title V of a larger law on human trafficking. Burr gained congressional support by citing hundreds of convicted military sex offenders we discovered had fallen off the public radar, endangering civilians. Like Matt Carr, who posed as a gynecologist and spent seven years in military prison after assaulting not one but seven women while in the Air Force. He got out, never registered, and found a new victim in Wisconsin. The law the president signed requires the Department of Defense to begin registering its offenders directly with the FBI and the National Sex Offender Public website before they get out of prison. Shortly before the president signed the bill into law, the mother of that sexual assault victim in Wisconsin wrote us to say thank you for giving voice to the victims. Mark Greenblatt for the Scripps Washington Bureau at the White House.